rights concern, Murik has issued a seven-day ultimatum to a Nigerian singer, David Adeleke, a.k.a. David Doom, to pull down his video which portrayed Islam in bad light or face spiritual or legal action or both. Murik founder and executive director, Professor Ishak Akintala, said this in a statement on Monday, July 24, 2023, in Abuja. Logos Olori, an artist under David Adeleke, a.k.a. David Doom, a Nigerian singer recently released a music video with the caption Jailo. In the video, some people dressed in white jalabias like Muslims were seen praying the way Muslims do before launching into dancing as they recited some Quranic verses and prayed. Marks were spread for those praying behind an imam who used the popular single prayer rock, Sajada. Those who were praying also read out what looks like Muslim recitations in Arabic language and prostrated the way Muslims do in prayer. Logos Olori himself was seen sitting on the roof of a mosque-like building mounted with a horn public address system, thus creating the complete impression of a mosque scenario. There is no doubt that the scene in the music video is a setting of a Muslim prayer session. But mixing it with singing and dancing is utterly wrong in concept and grossly misleading in content. In like manner, sitting on top of a mosque or what looks like it, with the type of loudspeaker used on top of mosques, is most primitive, extremely serpentine, and categorically unacceptable. We hereby give Derido and Logos Olori seven days ultimatum to pull down the music video or face spiritual or legal action or both. That video is a mockery of Muslim spiritual life and practice. We will therefore employ a spiritual weapon on those who attack our spiritual way of life. For the avoidance of doubt and for the sake of microscopic clarity, we assert that we Muslims do not joke with our religion. Others may, but that is their cup of tea. It amounts to artistic fanaticism to erode on the freedom and happiness of others with any kind of artwork. Murik will not stand akimbo while our religion is desecrated by those who lack respect for people's faith. Murik was instrumental to the banning of Files This Is Nigeria video and the Shaku Shaku drug dance in June 2018. Logos Olori's Jaye Logo suffered the same fate. Nigerian artists must learn to leave Muslims alone with their ways of life. We will continue to employ every legitimate means to stop them in their attempt to ridicule our faith. Irate youths in Medjugorje, the capital city of Bono State, some prominent Nigerian Muslims, including former aides to ex-president Muhammad Buhari, Bashir Ahmad, Senator Shil Sani, and actor Ali Nohi, criticized the video for disrespecting their religion and urged him to take down the video and apologize. After facing heavy criticism, the video finally removed the controversial video after 48 hours, but chose not to apologize for his action. In response to his perceived arrogance, some aggrieved Muslim youths in Medjugorje took to the streets and set a large banner featuring the video's picture on fire. A video circulating on social media captured the moment the youths publicly burned the banner as a form of protest against the singer's actions. While weighing in with his view on the controversy, Nobel laureate Professor Wuli Shenka on Tuesday, July 25, dismissed the claim that dancing in front of a mosque is an act of provocation, insisting that it is an affirmation of the unified sensibility of the spiritual in human. Reacting to the calls for an apology to the Muslim community by Senator Shil Sani and some other aggrieved Muslims, Shoinka said, it should come as no surprise that I equally and absolutely disagree with Shil Sani if indeed, as reported, he has demanded an apology from David Doe on behalf of the Muslim community. No apology is required. None should be offered. Shoinka maintained that dancing around a religious setting is a fundamental freedom all artists should be entitled to. He continues that dancing in front of a mosque cannot therefore on its own be read as an act of provocation or offense, but as an affirmation of the unified sensibility of the spiritual in human. Let us learn to read it that way. Those who persist in taking offense to bed and serving it up as breakfast should
should exercise their right of boycotting the video's products. No one quarrels with that right. However, it is not a cause for negative and inciting excitation, he said. From Lagos, this is Tina Timothy, News Express Nigeria Television.